Hi, here we are with my Polaroid Play Smart bed leveling issues. So the problem is that every time I print something, the left side of the bed is always, it ends up being closer after the print. So I got to go through the whole bed leveling and print calibration prompts again to re-level it. And as you can, so I'm going to run through this again on video this time. And the first step was to loosen these screws. And they are, all four of them. Okay. And I'm gonna say next. It's just gonna auto home super quick. I'm gonna try and keep my camera as steady as possible. All right. Now we're just gonna level this by twisting this corner first. I'm gonna do the all four and I'm gonna show you where all four are. Here we are. So it's a little different from what you usually do with your other 3D printers where you actually, you know, are looking for a little more friction than what the LCD says here. It says like the gap should really ideally be the thickness of the A4 size paper. So. This is where I'm where I have it at. Okay. And I I've leveled enough beds I can even visually level them, but so this is basically the thickness of an A4 size paper. Okay. So then I'm gonna go to the last one. And again as we can see, it's just a little bit there and it's roughly the same. Yeah, I probably can't see. There you go. Okay. Gonna go to the next one. Again, roughly the same. Just a little scratch. So here's the, the width of the paper. Go to the previous one. There we are. The first one, as you can see. It's about the same. On other printers, you usually are looking for the nozzle to be scratching the printer, so you can't really push, but you can pull, so it buckles. But here they say, keep it the thickness of the paper. So I've tried pretty much every setting. Nothing works. But this time I'm keeping it loose. Just for the heck of it. All right, we're pretty even now, so I'm gonna tighten these screws down. Right, then I'm gonna hit next. Confirm they're correct. And then finish. And now I'm gonna do the print bed calibration. This is to calibrate the center. So first, we're gonna do visual, and then we'll put the paper down there. So it's, if you see, it's basically the same as the four corners, pretty much, right? Okay, and now we're gonna put the, slide the paper down there. Carefully insert the paper, use arrow keys to feel the slight resistance, slight resistance when trying to remove the paper. So, it is. Not enough because there's barely any resistance. So I'm gonna drop it by, I'm gonna bring the app bed up by 0 0.05 mil. Okay. And now it seems good. And that looks about right. I'm gonna say completed, confirm to lock the current position. And it'll auto home. And now we're gonna try and print. When it prints, it prints well, all right? So these prints are from this guy. So when it prints, it prints really well. That's printing is not the problem, okay? And this is all Polaroid filament. So it prints really well. Uh, Benchy came out really, really nice. Uh, everything else came out very, very good. However, 
between every print. You see, I mean, my, my first layer, I mean, when I adjust the bed level, it's fine. Okay. Everything's good. Right. But after every print is done, it loses the level. So that's the biggest problem. Bed leveling is not the problem. And it keeps doing so unless I have to go through this whole cycle again. So here's my print. The print came out great, right? As you can see, the bed level is good. The print's looking really nice, so everything is good. Now I'm just gonna remove this print and I'm gonna start the next print and then we'll see what happens. Okay, print's removed. I'm gonna start a new one. And let's see. It's going to reach temperature. It's going to auto home first. No problems with auto homing. Or it's going to wait to reach temperature. We're approaching temperature. Anytime soon. I usually print my first layer a little hotter. Helps with the bed adhesion. There we go. Let's see. And there we go. Clearly bed levels lost as you can hear the extruder clicking also look at that the left side is really low the whole bed is low i mean closer to the nozzle and this is just horrible this is just bad every single time and all i did was finish a print start the same print again and there we go now i gotta Redo the whole bed leveling routine to get the level back. So I'm just gonna stop it now before I clog. And the, the feeder is still clicking, as you can hear. So cancel, confirm. I'll give you another good visual. Look at that. The left side is horribly low again. Every single time no matter what I do. And I have a lot of printers. A lot of printers. I mean, there's a couple more in the back. Yeah. So I kind of know 3D printing. So this is really bad. So I'm kind of at a loss. Firmware is up to date. There's the firmware version, 1.4.70. It's the latest. So I don't know, Polaroid PlaySmart, I don't know what's the deal with you. I'm pretty sure there's something going on with the bed.